Hey, hey, girls and Coco Puff, which we're questioning about. Actually, you know, a, a couple of people have said that they believe Coco Puff to be a hen. He's under there right now. To be a hen uh, and not a rooster, just a big old hen. So it looks like we got a lot of hens. I'm gonna spray these girls down because uh, Coco Puff over there looks like he's kind of suffering underneath there, so. Look out, I'm gonna spray you guys down a little bit. All right, get you some water. Yeah, you'll appreciate it later, trust me. Spray the area down a little bit, just a little moisture. The water pressure's not high because I've got the misters and everything else on. All right, I'll get the rest later. Plus this area's being misted constantly, so you guys are good. You're good. Yeah, there you go. Let's see how you're enjoying the new boxes and what I did up top. Okay, I took the boxes out from up top because all they were doing was getting the boxes and just pooping them up. So I just took the trays out. I just took the bottom trays out. Oh, look at you girls. Look at the new nesting area. Looks nice and clean. Look at that. Oh, Princess Leia, thank you. Looks a couple eggs there. There's actually, they look like a little poopy on the one of those eggs there. I don't appreciate that, but I did replace the bedding in there. So that's got to be nice for them. Yeah, so I guess we'll see soon enough. Uh, Coco Puff has not crowed, so maybe, maybe it's true. Maybe Coco Puff is just a big old hen. Just a big one, just huge, just massive. I don't know. We'll just have to wait and see. Right, girls? We'll have to wait and see what's going on with Coco Puff. Hey, Coco Puff. Hey. How's everyone doing? Yeah. Everyone doing okay? Everyone under there doing all right? Hey, Maybelline. Hey, Maybelline. How are you? You look good, girl, as always. Hey, how are you doing? How are you doing? You're doing good? You doing good, Red? Yes, yes, your water's kind of gross. Let's, let's, let's uh, uh, I know you guys are all into the, you think there's bugs everywhere. There's bugs. We got to get them. Not necessary. Watch your head. That happened last time. Oh my gosh, that was hilarious. Okay, no, not for them so much, but it was for me. I gotta come scrub it, it needs to be scrubbed. Look, the tarp in the back has kind of ripped apart, so looks like time to replace that. You know, they only last so long with the heat and the wind and everything, it's kind of expected. But we gotta get that replaced so you guys can keep getting some shade back there. Okay, all right, sounds good. Okay, everyone doing good? You all are? Awesome. Yes, that's fantastic. Yes, I, I see you in there trying to hide the eggs. It's okay, I'm not going to get those right now. I didn't even bring the basket with me. I know. What are you trying to say? Missy, miss, what? What's on your mind? And you, on your mind? What is it? Nothing? Side eye? Okay. All right, let's give this one a little bit of a rinse. No one put their head in, please. Can't guarantee your your safeness if your head's in there. Also, I can't guarantee your your safety with a uh, panini right outside the door. <laughs> All right. All right, girls and guy or whatever. We don't know yet. We're waiting to see. All right, I'll check you out later. Yeah, I got a treat for you, but it's later. I forgot to bring it out. Okay. Okay, yes, a little extreme, but okay, let's do this. <laughs> oh, uh, my tongs, oh, here they are, got them. I'm ready, that's my part. I gotta do the tongs. Okay, can you not, like, not towards me? I mean, like, my, my box, and like, just wondering, the animals, yeah, I don't know. All righty. Nothing like a little overkill. All right. I'm going to rest for a second there. Oh, okay.
Turn. All right, I'm going in. Okay. Wow. Those are blistering up nicely. Some of them are going to need a little bit more, obviously. We'll keep, we're going to have to turn a few times, so just FYI. You, you do know that, right? I know you think your master blaster torch is killing it, but, you know, there's got to be some. How much is killed? Additional flipping. Some additional killing? Some additional flipping. See the dogs left. Smart move on their part. There you go. Like do a little, yeah, a little evenly there. Nice. Moving the flame helps a little bit there. <laughs> All righty. Just move them. Just rotate them. We're ready to rotate one more time. Uh, some of them, are, oh, that one definitely needs a good rotation on it. Okay, that one like that, like that. Just like that. This one really needs to get all layers. We need to move some of the ones that are cooked already off. Hit these over here just a little bit more, one more time, and I'll move them off. Oh, that one definitely needs the other side. It smells so good. Yum. Well, those hatch chilies tasted amazing. What we did learn was that we needed to char them a little bit more and let them steam a little bit longer afterwards so they'll peel a little easier. But we made this delicious hatch chili pork stew that was amazing. I'll leave a link to that below. So thanks for stopping by the homestead today. And as always, be happy, be well, and be blessed. Until next time, we'll see you later. Bye-bye.